If you live in an area with cold winters, it's essential to look out for the safety of your cat and the cats who may live in your neighborhood. In this video, we will share some tips on how to keep cats safe during cold weather. But before we begin, we want to give a quick shout out to our good friends at Litter Robot, because they offer lots of products and cat equipment. Their most notable one is the automatic self-cleaning litter box that requires no scooping. If you check the link in the description down below, you can get $25 off on any purchase you make on Litter Robot. So shout out to them. Okay, let's get started with our video. How cold is too cold? When the weather drops to 40 degrees Fahrenheit, 7 Celsius, it will be too cold for standard house cats or cats who are either very young, old, or suffering health problems. Some outdoor cats and feral cats are better suited for toughing out the cold, but they still depend on our help for their survival. They are in danger of suffering the effects of long-term exposure to the cold at 32 Fahrenheit or 0 Celsius and below. Keep your cat indoors. The best thing you can do is keep your cat inside during cold weather months. Make the indoor environment as enriching for the cat as you can afford, and spend ample amounts of time with them. A perching area or cat tree situated by the window will help stimulate the mind of a cat who longs to be outside. Microchip your pet so that if they do get outside or get lost, you're more likely to be reunited with your cat. Outdoor Cats Some cats are truly outdoor cats. Certain areas have high numbers of stray or feral cats. If it's not possible to keep a cat indoors for whatever reasons, the next best thing one can do is provide outdoor cats with a safe, warm shelter. Cat Shelters Buy one or make your own. There are several cat shelters for sale designed to create a safe place that a cat can retreat from the cold. You set them up and maintain them for the cats who come and go. There is a great variety of DIY options for those inclined to make their own shelter. Benefits of building your own. A rewarding and meaningful project, even more fun with friends and family. Cheaper in cost than buying one. Customize the look and material choice. Make use of items on hand, some that may be hard to recycle, such as styrofoam-based ones. The U.S. Humane Society has an excellent amount of info on their website. I'll make sure to share that information in the description down below. Make sure to do some research before building a cat shelter. Food and Water Beyond the physical cold, consider that outdoor cats, like other animals, have difficulty scavenging for food and water in the winter. Cats need more calories to keep them warm when it's cold out, so it's especially important that they get enough to eat. Offer heated foods and water in a dry private area and check or change it regularly. Cats and travel. Make sure to bring an appropriate blanket or towel to help keep them warm. Note that knitted fabrics may get caught on the carrier and tangle up, making it difficult for your cat to get comfortable and stay warm. Heat the car ahead of loading your pet in and keep the duration of time outside to a minimum. Keep an emergency kit in your car, important regardless of if your cat is with you. And should there be an emergency or if your vehicle breaks down, you may be better prepared to protect yourself and your cat from the cold. Cats and Cars Even if you may not be able to maintain a cat shelter, you can help by checking your vehicle before starting your engine. In the cold, a cat may curl up in the warm underside of a car. This is obviously very dangerous for them. By honking the horn or slamming the doors, you can alert a sleeping cat who may have been hiding. Everyone can do their part to make sure all cats are safe over the winter. Now if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.